by the way. If you got Netflix, you can do live. You can do live live um, live screening. You can actually go to uh, to uh, to uh, Fox News or go to those. Uh, go to the um, the the live streaming channels and you'll pick up Hulu. You can pick up all these different stuff that you would get on on uh, uh, the highlights that you would find on Fox News without all the commercials. You can actually you can do that with uh, with Netflix, by the way. Now, it's only $10 a month. So you can actually take the back door and just go on Netflix or you go to Blockbuster or, or Blockbuster.com. You can sign up with them. It's like, 10, it's like $10 or $11 a month versus you're spending... Uh, say with Comcast, your, your cable, your internet. Oh, if you bundle it, it's like over hundred dollars. If you bundle it with uh, with Dish Network, it's like it's like uh, uh, it's over hundred dollars. But if you bundle it with Directv, you're looking at two or three hundred dollars. However, with with Comcastic, you're going to get charge of of three or four hundred dollars. So if you, so. Uh, if you bundle, I'm saying bundle your phone, internet with with, with direct with, with direct TV is like three or four hundred dollars. Comcast, you're looking at three or five hundred, four or five hundred dollars. And for uh, for direct for um, uh, Dish Network is uh, is one fifty is what it is altogether. So you're paying one hundred fifty bucks versus two or three or five hundred dollars with Direct TV and Comcast because they also give you hand in charges at least. At least Dish Network doesn't do that, you know, not so much. But they're trying to sneak that in too, as well, to the consumer too. I notice, and that's not right either. Well, I, you know, they're in business for a reason. Yeah, make money. And I, and I understand that. I don't have any problem with that. There's going to be hidden charges, uh, you know, no matter what kind of a programming contract you get. Right. And that's just part of the game. Uh, Sneaky. So what's going on right now as far as uh, blocking Fox or Fox pulling their channel, this needs to be settled. Yep. This needs to be settled. You know, um, the, the American consumer is not responsible for the programming that's not working out for Fox. Right. And you know something? Sometimes when you're in business, you just have to cut your losses and move on. Right. Right, and I know us too. Bill O'Reilly's got Will Williams on all the time. He's got Alan Combs. We try to get Alan Combs on here to actually debate him about what was going on with Amnesty. Also, what's going on uh, with uh, with Al Sharpton topic? Because you know, hands up, don't shoot. You know, we want to. I want to ask him some hard, hard. Hard questions. You would not. You would not get softballed by by Bill O'Reilly. That's what we do here. So we actually ask tough questions here. That's what we do, and we expose it the best way we can. And you know what? We actually had a the Democrat uh, who actually uh, was uh, w was working under um, uh, 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 Scott Walker, Scott Walker, you know his campaign manager. His campaign manager that he had was a registered Democrat, by the way, a black man. And we had him on. We spent over an hour with a. We spent over an hour with a guy. We spent over an hour, and Fox News never took that up. However, they actually reuse our own words, and they are, and that, and they said they came from an anonymous resource. But they, you see. Here, when we actually have a resource, what we do, we talked to, we had Newsmax, we mentioned the Blaze, we mentioned uh, the, the, the um, uh, where we, uh, even the, uh, the Examiner, and we also mentioned the um, Drudge Report. So we get three, three views was out there, and we give them full credit. Unlike Fox News, where they say it comes to anonymous source, sources, tells us, oh, what is the sources? I want to know where you get your sources from. Does it come from? Uh, does it come from the zombie? The 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 outer space zombies are out that that are out there infiltrating our, our, our news. You know, good question. Is that where it comes from? I want to know because there's been so much misleading, so much, um, uh, so so much misinformation. How do you know is what was truth or what's real? How do you know? I want to know.